Welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be reviewing tips for replacing the Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor on this 2015 Audi Q5 with a 2.0 liter T engine. Now let's get started. Okay, your sensor is located right there on the driver's side. You can see the red connector. Some of the symptoms associated with the faulty sensor include vehicle shaking, unstable idle, weak power, and shuttering of the vehicle. On our supply list today includes a new sensor and a T20 hex tool. And that's about it. So let's go ahead and remove this sensor. I'm going to remove that right there. It's pretty easy. There's two screws. Remove those using the hex tool. Gently wiggle. And here you go. Here's your sensor. This sensor looks like it's in pretty good shape. You always want to inspect the O-ring. This one feels a little pliable, which is good news. You can replace these O-rings. They have O-ring kits. It's a very uh, cheap kit. And you can replace these very, these very cheaply if that's your issue. This can also be cleaned. I highly recommend that if you're, anytime you're cleaning a sensor, that you let it completely dry before you reinstall it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and reinstall the sensor. So you're going to put it back in. Press down firmly, wiggle it back and forth like that, put it into place. You're going to reinstall your two screws. Be careful when you're putting these screws in so that you don't drop them. And this vehicle does have a cover on the bottom, and so if you drop those screws, then you're going to have to deal with the cover especially the screw on the right side. Um, be careful of that one. Okay. And I've got them installed by hand. I'm using the tool, just tighten them down a little, mo little more before I use the ratchet. Okay, and there you go. You want to look at the rubber gasket in here, make sure it's in the correct form and it's not distorted. Push down, listen for the click. There's the click. And there you have it. This wraps up this video on this 2015 Audi Q5 with the 2.0 turbo engine. I hope you found my tips to be helpful. Please like and subscribe. And until next time, drive defensively.